It appears to be another down day on light volume. What's up, everybody? Welcome aboard to Bubba's Daily Update for Tuesday, the 14th of June. And, well, I don't know, markets are kind of mixed at the moment, uh, but they were much higher earlier, and they're slowly giving it up. And uh, you got a pretty much of a mixed picture right now. We're short across the board. Uh, but in general, this looks like a pretty weak market. Looks like we could be in for another another beating. Uh, volumes are light, which indicates that there's no real panic in selling here. There's no real uh, fear in, in, in what's going on. In fact, the the VIX is actually down on the day, uh, and this market is starting to head south. So we'll see. I mean, it could get. We could see another replay of yesterday. I mean, we could reverse and go higher. It could go anywhere, but the volume is light, which indicates that the selling. Is very orderly and without panic, which would indicate that there's a lot of room to go on the downside, which is what we've thought uh, all along. Uh, so I think we are headed south and we are short across the board. Uh, in the uh, in the crude market, crude is flying higher. We're long. But interesting enough, there must be some news. I haven't seen it yet, but natural gas is getting crushed today, uh, down uh, almost 20%. Uh, down about a buck and a half. I haven't seen the news. We're still long. Unfortunately, that's a that's an ouch. But at the end of the day, it, it, it is what it is, and we'll see what, what it looks like later in the day. Uh, gold is lower, and we're long. Silver is getting hammered, and, and we're short still. So again, this is the, the picture. I, I suspect gold is going to test 1,800. It looks like silver is going to test 20. All right. Uh, the bonds are flat, and notes are flat. We're still short uh, in the... Uh, uh, the dollar is is higher and we're long. Bitcoin is down another thousand. We're still short. Uh, the uh, copper market, which we're short, is down again today. Uh, again, we're seeing a lot of reasons to believe we're going substantially lower here, pretty much across the board. Uh, I think that you'll start to see the commodities start to pick up a little bit soon. But right now, the uh, in the grain markets, you've got the corn and wheat are both lower, beans are higher, and we are short corn and wheat and long beans. Uh, in the in the meats, they're pretty much flat across the board. So we're 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 long cattle, and we're short hogs. Uh, we're pretty much flat. So there's, there's not much to report there at the moment. But I would suspect that although we're long cattle, I'd probably prefer to be short here. I think it goes the opposite of natural gas. In the softs. Uh, cotton is lower, we're short. Cocoa is lower, we're short. Uh, coffee is flat, we're long. Sugar is lower, we're short. OJ is flat, and we're long. And, you know, look, at the end of the day, it looks like it could be an ugly picture. Uh, there's a lot of problems out there and, and a lot of things in this economy that don't make sense. And we've got the Fed tomorrow, which, which could lead to some sidewards trade today. Uh, you know, they're probably going to hike and the talk is a half to a full percent. I would be surprised if they don't go a full percent. Uh, so we'll see what it looks like. In the meantime, uh, there will be no update tomorrow. I'll be traveling. But in the meantime, be careful out there. It, it is a challenging market because it's very quiet and it's very orderly and it's very slow. So make sure you pick your spots. And remember our sponsors, Capital Trading Group, Trading Group, Trading Group Brokerage in our high school program. They're scrolling on the sides and on the bottom. In the meantime, have a great day, everybody. This is Bubba's Alley Update for Tuesday, and we'll see you back here again on Thursday. No update tomorrow. Have a great day, everybody. We'll see you later.